Hey guys, we're here today with Philip from Slice in their beautiful London office. Slice is also focusing on the mobility sector and I, as a German loving cars, have a big question. Why? Auto insurance, motor insurance is, is the biggest segment of insurance premiums, you know, definitely in, in, in PNC or general insurance. Uh, mobility is changing dramatically from the OEM's perspective, you know, how we sell cars, how we finance cars is changing, how we build cars is changing, and what cars are on the road is changing. And there's a huge opportunity for insurers and anyone involved in mobility, whether it be manufacturers, car hailing companies, car sharing companies, anyone else with other forms of mobility to really come together and look at what will insurance look like in this new world. So how do you think the mobility sector will look like uh, in a few years? Well, I think it's going to be very different. You know, so today I have an annual auto policy, maybe in some jurisdictions, maybe a six month policy. It's a static policy that really doesn't look at anything for that period of time. If we look at mobility as a service today and everything that's available to me, I might start my day driving my car, then I might get into an Uber, I might use a car sharing service, I might even get on a scooter later in the day. My insurance needs change, my exposure, the risk that I present, you know, changes throughout the day and is different from day to day. So why not use insurance and have insurance products that are really tailored to how people move today, not only from a product perspective, but also how we engage, how the insurance company engages with the customer. One condition for this is the availability of data, also the availability of 5G. Considering we have all that, what do you think um, is going to happen then? Yeah, well, insurance is a business that's all based on data, but it's based on historical data. So we, we've traditionally used historical data to predict the future. Now we live in a world where we can have, because of what you said, 5G and other factors, we have access to data in real time. That data, the, the OEMs have it, right? The vehicles are producing gigabytes of data per day. That data can inform the insurance company on driving patterns, location, etc. that can help them basically deliver better products. So the opportunity is really for the two to work together and, and come up with new products, new offerings, you know, that are tailored to how we use mobility today, which is very different than the way we did it just 10 years ago. So what is it gonna look like 10 years from now? So, if you made it to here, it means you really like the video. It would mean the world to me if you could hit the subscribe button down here or sign up for our newsletter so we can give you all the hottest, newest trends we scout around the world for free even sooner.